Hey, Anonymous Bicycles here. Another cold day in Connecticut. Um, Sub-zero outside. That's why I got to bundle up in here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and change my chain rings out today. And, uh, get started. I'll show you what tools I'm going to use um, just in case you're interested in doing this yourself. What I have here is a set of metric Allen wrenches. A, one tor um, a torque wrench that I'm going to need to put the drop pin on the, uh, the large sprocket. Got a cheater bar. Uh, because uh, those um, retaining nuts on the crank are kind of hard to, to take off. And a uh, specialty tool from Park, this actually removes the crank. It's a uh, crank puller, crank removal tool. Um, let me see, yeah, little parts thing. Uh, and a little piece of PVC end cap for parts. Uh, vice grip with something or other on there to hold the back of those uh, little nuts that hold the chain rings together and a pen in case I screw everything up and I need to write a suicide note. We have our crank here. We have five, um, five bolts we have to take off. Five nuts. These screw right into the spider arm. They all, um, all of these come off with the, uh, with the Allen wrench. So we're going to go ahead and uh, start taking it apart. These shouldn't be on here too tight. Okay, I'm just finishing up here. I like to get all this stuff kind of clean. Uh, these are the backside nuts that hold the chain rings on. And in case you were wondering, this is just a little pair of ice grips with a um, window blind bracket or something I had laying around. And it fits right in that little slot. If you have a bigger screwdriver, then you're good to go. Or if you have the proper tool, you're good to go. But this, this works for me. You know? Okay. This is a little dropout um, pin that you have to put on so that the chain doesn't drop out and between the, between the, your outer gear and your crank. And again, these are uh, TA specialty, made in France. Ooh la la! Okay, let's just um, let's go ahead and put them on. A few things. On all three of these, um, there's a little reference. On some there's a tab on here. I think you can notice there's an actual arrow. And on the other side of the arrow, there's a little screw hole. And the screw hole has that little drop pin, a dropout pin that goes between um, this chain ring and your sprocket. I mean, and, excuse me, goes between the chain ring and the crank so that the chain doesn't fall in between the crank, right? On the, like I said, the opposite side, there's a, there's a, a little uh, arrow. All of the, all the chain rings have that little arrow. And all the arrows line up. All the arrows line up. So on the opposite side of the arrow is going to be the crank with your the crank with your pedal. All the arrows are going to be on the opposite side. And they're all going to line up. Okay, let's do this.
Yeah, I used some Loctite on that, uh, that dropout pin on the screw, and uh, it required a Torx wrench. Okay, so before, before we put this together, I'm just going to put another dab of, uh, dab of grease on there. A little dab will do you. Good thing to remember is it's got to go the other way, opposite of your other crank. And I put the chain back up there just to make it easier. Alright, so this just spins on there. And this is what's going to actually put that back on the wedged. Uh, bracket there. Now, they do say a torque wrench is a good thing to have here. I don't have a torque wrench. So they say each one is kind of different as far as how much how much uh, torque you want to put on it. But, um, they call them Newtons, foot-pounds, right? I call, I say it in French, call them beaucoup, beaucoup torque. If you can um, do it like this without getting a cheater bar on there or anything, then you're good to go. No, that's not coming off. Okay, everything's everything's shifting good, but I need to I need to adjust my uh, my rear derailleur. It's not with the new um, the new uh, gears on the back, the new cassette on the back, and this on the front. I'm gonna have to readjust the uh, the derailleurs and stuff like that. That's just a little tweak here, a little tweak there. We should be good to go. Um, but that was um, that's changing out your front chain ring, and um, again. Thanks for watching.